everyone, how are you? Today I'm bringing you something a bit different and special. This is my tribute to Sailor Moon since this year we're celebrating its 20th anniversary. I've had this Draculaura sitting in a corner for ages, so it was about time I did something with her. Here is a quick recap of what I'm doing. After removing her factory paint, I seal her face three times to prevent staining and to build a bit of a paper-like texture so that my materials show up when drawing. The repainting process is quite simple in theory. I simply use watercolor pencils, gouache paints and pastels to paint her the way I want. You probably can't tell from the video, but I keep sealing her face multiple times throughout the process because it helps building up color intensity. I usually start with a lighter color and then slowly build up to the shade that I want. I always work with the same type of materials, so if you're curious about exactly which brands I use, you can find the links to my frequently asked questions and Q&A videos in the description box. Oh, and if you want to know how I removed her original painted face, I explain how to do it in another video, which I will also link in the description box. Since we're talking about basics, I use Liquitex Matte Medium and Matte Varnish in conjunction with my airbrush to seal her face. For more details and a full step-by-step -step video about sealing, check my other face-up stories titled Brush on Sealants. Here at the very end I'm using some gold acrylic paint, a bit of shimmer to highlight her features and some nice gloss to make her look super cute. And here she is! It is quite a delicate and simple face-up with minimal blushing. What do you think? Does she look good? I also made her a wig. It was probably the most challenging wig I've ever done, but I'm quite happy with how it turned out. I'm still waiting for her proper clothes and to receive her magical items, but as soon as she's all done, I'll make another video showing her again. I hope you've enjoyed this video, thank you so much for watching. If you like what I do and want to see more, Please support me by subscribing, liking, sharing and commenting. This video was a bit late so thanks for being so patient. But don't worry, my next box opening will be up on YouTube next week as per schedule. Well that is all, see you next time, bye!